What is going on everybody? It is Ranger Marcus or Marcus Raman and this weekend we are herping in Southern Oregon. And for this trip we have a very specific target. We have the California Mountain Kingsnake, which is sensitive in this area. This means that the population is possibly dwindling, but we have permits, so no need to worry. So I'm meeting up with my boy Max and we're gonna look for some mountain king snakes. And anything else we find this week will be a bonus. So before we get into today's video, I'm gonna take you to Central Oregon on what we found this week for work. And we have our first Skilton Skink of the week. This one's got a nice red chin, a little bit of a blue tail. And here's Skink number two, lost its tail. It's biting me. I'm, I'm gonna put them back though. And Skink number three, all in very close proximity to each other. This one's got a nice blue tail also. So we just flipped a long-toed salamander. And technically this is a lifer for me, a species I've never seen before because this is a central long-toed salamander where you guys have seen the western long-toed. This guy is like four inches or so. Um, a lot smaller than a lot of the other uh, Ambystema genus. It has been incredibly difficult to take pictures of this guy because he will not stop moving, just like the newts that you guys have seen in previous episodes. Uh, so we're going to put this guy back under his log, and uh, we're going to get back to work. Here is one last look at the long toad. There he goes. This right here is a larva long-toed salamander. Very small, but you can see it's got the, the little toes growing there. So I flipped them over here and you can see that's where the gills would be. And the legs are just starting to grow there. We just flipped this common sagebrush lizard. It is different from the Western fence. They have a black mark right on the shoulder. The snout is not as pronounced and the stomachs have a lot less blue. This is probably, I'm not sure if this is a male or female, but a lot less blue than you usually see on the Western fence lizards. Right in the middle there is our first snake of the week. It's just a valley garter snake. Let's see how close I can get. There he is, deeply in shed. So we got two Oregon spotted frogs. One is right in the middle there. And the other one is also right in the middle there. Two Oregon spotted frogs. There's a closer look at one of them. This is a closer look at the red spotted frog. Oregon spotted frog, my bee. Got a cool white there with a little bit of red. The snake. This might be the smallest toad I have ever seen. This is a western toad. Nice find. Just found this nice big organ spotted frog. Some nice red coloration. This is a, and this is a female. It does not have the pads on the thumb. So this is a female organ spotted frog. It's a big one though, very red. There's an osprey all the way at the top of this tree. Kind of hard to see, but it's right in the middle there. So we just stumbled across a female mallard and she has a nest all the way up here with a bunch of eggs. And we are not even close to the water all the way down there. It's not sure why the nest is up here in the mountains, uh, but kind of cool find though. All right, now back to today's video. All right, in our first flip, we have a gopher snake right here, Pacific gopher snake. We're gonna pull them out real quick. So here is a closer look at this gopher snake. It is in shed, as you can see with that blue eye there, um, but it's got some nice pink coloration on the bottom side there. But we're gonna put this guy back because we are looking for king snakes. 
So I just spotted this huge Northern Pacific rattlesnake basking out here. And it's like 65, 70 degrees, uh, not hot out at all with the wind. And it's still basking out here. Looks like it's in shed, just like the gopher snake. Got that blue eye there. I'm gonna get you some closer video though. Yeah, it looks like a good snake. startled this guy. I didn't even know he was there. It's going to be right under this rock here going in. So this guy has now tucked himself all the way back there. I found him about five minutes after that first one there. The second rattlesnake, it's got some nice white to it. Hard to see because of the lighting, but rattlesnake number two. Finished this spot with two rattlesnakes and a gopher snake. We are now going to go to our last place of the day and road cruise and hike. So this is the new habitat that we're looking at. We have a river flowing right here. We have some rock slopes and then we have our road cruising road and more rock slopes over there looking for the mountain king. All right, guys, we just flipped our first lifer of the trip, a species I've never seen before, the Siskiyou mountain salamander. Kind of like the black salamander, but a little more brown. And uh, you can see that white coloration there. Pretty cool, not, not a very big salamander. I'm gonna get some pictures of it though. Hopefully we can find some more. So we just flipped this Northern or Southern alligator lizard. We're not really sure. It looks like a Southern, but it has um, some characteristics of Northern as well. So we're not really sure, but we're gonna put this guy back and keep looking. Just flipped this smaller Siskiyou mountain salamander. This one has lacked the spotting on the sides like the last one but gonna put this guy back under a rock just flipped an even smaller one of the mountain salamander all right i just saw this guy on the crawl we have a western terrestrial garter snake it's got some pretty cool patterning it's starting to musk though uh, so we're gonna put this guy back no need for pictures we got this northern alligator lizard here it's doing a very nice display um, it's got some pretty cool markings there on the back Kind of see there he's very mad so this is some of the habitat that we're looking at for the king snake now for tonight hopefully the sun has hit these rocks pretty good where we can flip some of them and if not then we'll road cruise them tonight so we did not see anything yesterday while road cruising the temperatures were too cold so we are now at a new site this morning and my first find i think is a foothill yellow-legged frog but we're gonna get a closer look at it. So here's a closer look at this foothill yellow-legged frog. You can see there, it's got the yellow legs. But we're gonna put this guy back and keep looking for king snakes. And here's our first lizard of the day. We have a Western fence lizard. He's gonna get, let me get really close to it. Oh, well, maybe not. So this is the new site that we're at. Uh, we're gonna be hiking this mountainous trail here and it opens up towards the top. Hopefully we can find a king snake here. And here we got our first skink of the weekend, a skilton skink, which you have seen earlier in this episode. A very nice bright blue tail. Skilton Skink. We just found another Northern Pacific rattlesnake here. Haven't seen anything in hours, but this guy is coiled up absolutely perfectly. So I'm gonna try to get a little bit closer.
All right, guys, that is gonna do it for me here in Southern Oregon. In the beginning of this video, we were in Central Oregon looking for the Oregon spotted frog for work, but we were able to find the Oregon spotted frog and the Central long-toed salamander, a lifer for me. And for here in Southern Oregon, we were able to turn up a gopher snake, a Western terrestrial garter snake, and three Northern Pacific rattlesnakes, which is my first here in Oregon. We also turned up another lifer yesterday, which is the mountain siskiyou salamander. Also a couple skinks found throughout the video. If you made it this far in the video, thanks for watching. Like the video, subscribe to the channel. Peace. And as we were walking back to the car after I made the outro already, a Pacific gopher snake decided he wanted to join us on the trail. Uh, we're going to pick this guy up though, probably. Well, this guy is uh, being kind of defensive, um, but he's not bitey. So we're going to put this guy back and uh, that's going to conclude the video. Thanks for watching.